Hey guys, it's Evan the Cat King here with another video. Today is another total drama what if. Today is what if Scarlet wasn't evil. That is what this one is. So yeah, we're going into what 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 how would Pocket Tail Island play out if Scarlet wasn't secretly evil? What if Scarlet in this it's Scarlet is just a is just a normal person. She's just a really smart person. She ain't evil. That that's 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 the gist of this what if. Um and that's what we're going with. So this and I we are going to start I believe that thing we're just going to go straight to Scarlet Fever as I did think about what it, like would this like change like any other episodes and I don't believe that would be the case. Um, <clears throat> because, again, Scarlet is still very smart. Maybe she wouldn't help Max, like, do, like, some of his evil uh, schemes as much. But I think that, ultimately, things wouldn't really change. So, s we're just gonna go to Scarlet Fever, where... And this is the, the where it actually... So, here we go. Um, her, her, so, in this... Scenario, her and Max will reach the control room. It, it's still the exact same situation of the island is still blowing up. Her and Max reach the control room. I don't know if she would actually, like, steal the, like, or, like, get Chris to give her, like, the iPad or whatever. She might still do that just because that, that might not really be her being evil. That's just her being smart. But even if she doesn't, I feel like she'd be able to find out how to reach there faster than everyone else. And then she gets in, like, you normal. And then instead of <clears throat> playing, like, chicken with Chris or whatever, um, and threatening to let the whole island blow up, she just stops it, turns off the self-destruct sequence thing, and saves everyone. This will give her immunity from the vote. That we're gonna have, that's gonna have a vote that happens this time, and the person that is getting voted off is, sadly, Jasmine. As people like Sugar and Scarlet would likely target her over the fact that she is a threat. And Sugar got Sky to agree to an alliance, and Max can easily be told what to do by Scarlet, I feel like. So I believe that this is where Jasmine goes here. And just because she is the biggest threat. Skyfall. Now we do have the pur the purge challenge, the race to the top of the mountain thing. Um, now I am going to make a judgment call and have there be this one is going to be a double elimination, because in Scarlet Fever there was originally two people who went, that being Scarlet and Max. Max is just a completely unfair elimination for um com for just no reason at all just like I, uh, like oh i don't i don't want to deal with evil people anymore so he just throws max in as well so we're just uh, so but here we're gonna have it be a double elimination where the two where it's the top three who make it to the top move on the bottom two end up not making it now i think that we can we can give sean and sky their like i think that they can confidently make it to the top but, um, like, they were the first two in the original. There was, like, some situations that probably wouldn't happen in this universe. But I feel like they can, they're pretty competent. And I think that they'll make it to the top. Making it a race between Scarlet, Max, and Sugar for who doesn't go home. And out of these three, S Scarlet has, is, de is probably the best that would be the first one to the top of these three sugar does make it in the original but she doesn't have but i don't think like she's just i i don't think sugar is going to be able to pull it off if anything scarlet might actually be the first one to the top scarlet is just that smart and i think it ultimately ends with Sc max and sugar getting eliminated now pocked with talent this challenge is never fun to think about because we need to figure out what people would choose to be their challenge. This isn't that bad, though, as Scarlet has definitely got some skills that would allow her 
to pick a challenge that is very easy for her while being pretty difficult for the others. This leads me to come to the conclusion that Scarlet <clears throat> will be going to the finale and will be joined by Sky, as I believe that we would end up going to Scarlet's into Scarlet's challenge, all tied up like in the original, with that Sky is probably gonna be maybe not smarter than Sky, at least book book smarts probably smarter than Scott in like, I mean Sean, not Scott, Sean. Um, probably got, like, the, the, the book smarts of Scarlet. I think Sky does, in fact, beat Sean in, resulting in her beating Sean in the end. With our final two, and in the finale, both getting their own canon and non-canon endings and whatever, is Scarlet and Sky. So, that is my conclusion Do you, uh, on what would happen if Scarlet wasn't evil if she was just super smart. That's 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 the gist of it and Yeah, I, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I I've I like to make it like I'm, I'm gonna say I'll say you know I'm gonna start doing it. I'm gonna start saying if I like this outcome more or less than the original outcome I think that this is a worse outcome just based on Sean and Jasmine if neither of them make it to the finale, then this season is just straight up not fun. Because <laughs> then the finale is just not worth watching. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time. It's a pretty short what if, but that's Pocketail Island. I don't like to talk about it for very long, so <laughs> it's better than All Stars, though. So see you guys next time. Bye.